I can't breathe. <laughs> All right, we're getting ready to start the first of our mystery food challenges. I picked out four items. The bras have no idea what they are. So they are going to get three points if they can identify the item and two points for actually consuming the item. So this should be interesting. I'll list what they're getting ready to eat on the screen. Yeah, now let's see who wins. On the count of three. <laughs> yeah. One, <laughs> two, three. Can you identify it and can you consume it? Hmm. And uh, we'll just wait if you guys can both. It looks like you're having no issues consuming it. Um. That's a look of disgust on Marty's face. <laughs> My first guess is not good. It tastes familiar, but does it? Okay, well, you both get points for uh, consumption. What about our guess? Uh, I'm going to say rhubarb. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to taste some kind of a potato. I'm probably, well, I'm just going to say a potato. All right, in general, a potato. Okay, so you both uh, failed the second part. That was avocado. Oh. Huh. And that was a softball. Now Man. it gets a little more difficult. I knew it tasted familiar. <laughs> Two, three. <laughs> like in the look of nervousness on your face. <laughs> you guys are real good if you get this one. I don't know. I'm, I'll give my guess first. All right. I'm just going to say pea soup. Well, it's a good guess. It's um, in the ballpark somewhat. Um, because again, it tastes familiar, but I can't put my finger on it. To me, it tastes like some kind of a off, like a weird tuna. I'm going to say uh, kind of tuna. All right. Well, I guess we can't give points to either one of you on that. You get it for the consumption, but if you would have got this, you would have been unbelievable. That was <laughs> turkey and gravy baby food. Hmm. Poor baby. <laughs> <laughs> is this a fork or a spit? This one is going to be a fork. Oh, good. That's there. at least better. Yeah, well, there's one for you and one oh, for no. you. If you want to do your usual countdown. <laughs> Oh, we're already getting sick. <laughs> I'm, I'm psyched out. Well, Hold part on. of it, yeah, is just the unknown. <sighs> I'm trying to. I mean, it's nothing too awful. <laughs> well, there's a smell, though, that's starting to. <laughs> mm. <laughs> are we are you gonna do this? Yeah, you gotta do it. Just get yeah. it over with. Whenever you are. Mm. <laughs> There's a stench and I think I know the stench. You... <laughs> I can sm yeah, I, I think I know what would... smell, but you completely lose the challenge. Right now you guys are tied. I guess with the count of three. Okay. Oh God. One, two, three. Mike consumed it. <laughs> what was your guess? Now I got tears rolling down my cheeks. That is I don't know, a scallop. Uh, I can't even tell. Uh, actually, a good guess. I could see why you would say Oof. that. It's hmm. a uh, a pickled beet. Oh, huh. That's 
<laughs> right, Marty needs some time. You guys are ready? So right now Mike is he's about to win this challenge. The inaugural mystery food challenge. <clears throat> oh, there's my hand shaking a little bit. <laughs> I guess I'll let you count down whenever you're ready. If that's the case, pause it. I'm kidding. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Alright, three, two, one, go. Well, it looks like the consumption won't be. And it's funny, I thought maybe this would be the one just because of the consistency. Seems to be an enjoyable treat. Hmm. I should have saved the uh, pickled beets for last. It's got a pot roast. It's, um, I'm going to say a pork roast. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to say a can. Oh, what's the, the little canned meat that has like the devil on it? Oh, um, I know exactly what you're talking <laughs> about. Because I can't tell. It wasn't bad, whatever it was. But <laughs> I'm going to go with that. <laughs> okay, I know what the canned meat, what you're talking about. Uh, you're actually both, I mean, you were in the ballpark, it was Spam. Oh. Huh. So now you realize you enjoy Spam. Spam is better than pickled beef. <laughs> so Mike is the winner of this challenge. The inaugural challenge. Never take that away from me. <laughs> we will be back.